I'm going to beat Elden Ring just by being fat. Obviously, I can't do this by just existing as a fat character, so here are the rules. One, I can only deal damage with attacks that either utilize my chunky belly or my thick cheeks. So that means things like Wrath of Gold that bump out the character's stomach to do damage, and obviously Ground Slam that jumps up into the air and sits on enemies to deal damage. And two, I need to beat all of the Remembrance bosses, including Melania and Rikard. Make sure to subscribe to not miss runs like this in the future and follow me on Twitch to watch live. Thank you to Bloodline Heroes of Lithis for sponsoring today's video. It's a free to play hero collector fantasy RPG on iOS and Android. Build your kingdom and experience the unique twist on the hero collector genre where there are multiple different bloodlines or families like orcs, demons, werewolves, and vampires that you can marry together to create hybrid offspring that has the benefits and drawbacks of both of their parents. You can even manage manage your hero's intimacy towards each other, that way they make their descendants even more powerful. And starting soon, Bloodline is having a massive event for Halloween, adding the new Accursed Vampire Clan, and you can get an Accursed Champion for free by playing for 7 days starting on October 27th. Download and try out the game for free using my link in the description to support my channel, and when you do, that will get you a special starter pack worth $20 containing 10 energy potions, 100,000 gold, and 100 diamonds. We're looking for faith and strength, which... Confessor? Yeah, yeah, I guess. The start of this run is a bit difficult because almost every attack I can use is locked behind doing damage of some sort. And obviously, if I don't have a butt or belly attack, I'm not allowed to do any damage. The only attack that isn't locked behind combat is the incantation Wrath of Gold. But the issue there is that it's all the way up in Altus Plateau. So to get there, I gather both of the Dectus medallions from Limgrave and Kaled, then run my horse up to Liurnia, picking up the Faith Talisman along the way. I'll be using that later riding the Dactus lift up and picking up Wrath of Gold from this basement. Next problem is, Wrath of Gold requires 32 faith to cast, and as a confessor, I only have 14 faith. The faith talisman raises that to 19, and with the faith physic tier, I can get it up to 29 for 3 minutes. With all that, I can easily farm 3 levels so that I can actually finally do damage to gather the Golden Slam Ash of War, the Ground Slam Ash of War, which is honestly just a worse version of Golden Slam, but I wanted to pick it up anyway in case I found a use for it, and finally I picked up the Smithing Stone Bell Bearing 1 to level up my Finger Seal to plus 8 so that I'm ready to fight Margit. Alright, can I charge this up here? Maybe. Probably not, to be honest. Uh, hello? What we doing? I don't like this medium roll thing. Give me that fast roll. Show off the curves. <laughs> Back roll. Back roll. There we go. Love to see it. Can I do this? Uh, doubtful. Good. Back roll. Back roll. Very nice. Charge it up. Beautiful. No charge. Excellent. It's unfortunate. Go. Oh fuck, come on. Ah! Ah, 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 ah. Ah, 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 ah. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, you know, fuck it. Well, who needs to heal? Not us, bro. You aren't dead? I feel like you're. Ah! Oh, yeah, 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 I also kind of need to go because if I don't, I'm going to run out of, run out of physic. Oh, that's not good. Stop. What? How did that not roll? Huh? Yeah, we're chilling. No issues. What the hell was that? There you go. 
I'll charge it all the way up just to fucking BM you. You shit sack. Dude, look. The physic like just ran out. I had, I had like a couple spare seconds. At this point, I bought and leveled up two weapons to put both Golden Slam and Ground Slam on them. Later, I did eventually realize that I really only need one weapon leveled up because both of these Ashes of War are the same animation, just doing slightly different amounts and types of damage. So I will never have a use for both of them in the same fight. And instead, it's better to just save the runes and upgrade materials by only upgrading one weapon. I also pick up the Strength Knot tier because I wanted a test if Golden Slam and Ground Slam scale with Strength. They don't but that's the reason why I'm using strength tier in this Godric fight. Let's see if the slam or the gr the golden slam or the ground slam does more. Four oh five. It is slow. A lot more FP efficient though. Got to give it that. Three thirty seven. Okay. So we like the golden slam right now. And the, ow, the benefit that I see here, even though it's a lot slower, is that it, it gives me a whole lot more functional FP. Why did that only do 165? What happened there? Did it like not directly impact? What? Let's see what the belly bump does out of curiosity. It's not awful, but when he goes for this move, I think I go for the butt slam. Because more better. <laughs> I didn't drink this. Probably should. Sounds like a good idea. Can I butt slam here? Well, I got away with it, but not really. And this will be a nice, clean butt slam that misses. Nice. Slam him. Slam again. Oh, come on. I feel... What? I feel absolutely cheated, dude. Give him the belly bump. Bang. Belly bump. Oh yeah, aided it out, dude. All right, there we go. So you, you kinda, hello, hello? Dude, what? What do you mean? How am I not rolling? There we go. All right, it seems like we got plenty of blue to the point where I can probably just get away with this. Oh, yeah. Hit him with the cheeks, baby. Go sit on Radon, I guess. That's not good. That's not good at all. Okay. I think I can only get away with that until that starts shooting out the wave then i'm probably not having a good time there what about this all right <laughs> let's go see if the physical slam does better yeah you trying to do phase transition yeah hi Okay, so if I go to the right spot with the ground slam, we can get away with that. I don't think I'm going to get away with this. Oh my god, I did. Huh. Well, th this is going much better than expected. <laughs> Having a good time here. Clapping Radon's cheeks with my cheeks. Overpowered. Uh, is this late? Nah, we're chilling, bro. 
Look at us go. Chief. Jump. Let's go. Okay. Why? Why, bro? Why? Why? Why are you fucking me, dude? Ha! Game! Probably not a smart idea. Let's go murder a dog and a grieving single mother. All right, come here, bitch. That looks about right. I'm out of FP. Bitch. Right in the butthole, baby. Belly bump the butthole. Let's see. Can I act slam him? No. Technically. Jump. Well, I, I did not mean to press that. Jesus Christ. We have business, Moongrum. Ow. Uh... You seem to have not fallen into the pit. This is this is not going according to plan. <laughs> Excellent. Slam! WWE moves on the children, baby. <laughs> Wait, I I only killed two. Did I get a fucking double in there or something? Oh, she can break the bookshelves with those. I didn't know that. Come on, keep on slamming, baby. Am I going for three? Fuck it, I'm going for three. That, uh, yeah, that went about as expected. All right, there we go. Now we just need to give her the old one, two. The old double cheek. Bing. Bang. Boom. Okay, okay. Excuse me, madam. Let's go sell something and buy rejection. Wait, this two-handing? Since there's strength scaling, does this do more damage? 534. Bang! Wait, wait, it definitely did. Wait. Yeah, it did, right? Okay, good to know. There it is, baby. Bang! Like, where do I even... Okay, this is this is where we end the plan. Bang! <laughs> Boom! Get fucked, dogs! I'm going for it. You can't stop me. Bang! That's right, dogs. How are you alive? Bang! 
Oh yeah, here comes the slam. Yacht. Okay, how did that not give me full damage? Oh yeah, baby. Oh, get out the moon. Yeah, baby. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Slam! That's right. Get sat on. All right. Got a, a bunch more health now. Easiest first try Radon of my life incoming. I, I can't really do this. Wait. 494. Do the direct impacts not do faith damage? If it doesn't do faith damage or holy damage, what the fuck does it do? <laughs> like it doesn't even do partially faith damage or holy damage. It, it, it literally doesn't do anything. I, how is this not holy damage? Hey, jump. Thank you. Fuck, why, why are you doing this right here? Fuck. She, oh my God, that was nightmarish. Come on, chief. Good. I could have picked up this bell bearing earlier to get a little bit more damage, but this is a challenge run and I didn't want to just over level everything and beat it easily. This allows me to level both my seal and my dagger to plus 12. I also progressed through Ronnie's quest line to the point where EG would sell me the carrion filigreed crest so that I could make my ashes of war cost a little bit less. After that, I went back to Altus Plateau to pick up the ritual sword talisman since there isn't actually a whole lot of good talismans for this build and I'm just trying to get as much benefit as I can. And now you may be asking, why not use Sacred Scorpion Charm since Golden Slam obviously does holy damage? And the answer is a little bit strange. I did pick up Sacred Scorpion Charm, but Golden Slam is really weird because it apparently only does physical damage if it hits the target before hitting the ground, and will only do holy damage if it hits the ground before hitting the target. And since hitting the target directly does a little bit more damage, that's why Sacred Scorpion Charm isn't actually that good for this build. Wait, what? Wait. It staggers him? Wait, that's huge. Okay, I can only get three out. Three per bar. Ow. But I think that's fine. I think we have enough damage. I, I I definitely expected this tree sentinel to be like actually quite the problem. I thought we were going to have FP issues and like damage window issues. But no, we're just belly bumping, bro. Can I do this? S stupid idea. <laughs> yeah. That was dumb. That was also dumb. All right. Let's live. And then let's belly bump him. Love to see it. I mean, I guess since we're not going to be picking up the, the fatty suit for a while, I guess we get to wear Leonel's chest piece. All right, sir. No, spin. 372. Is that going to be enough? It's also going to go down whenever the physic runs out, which hopefully is not any... I didn't spin enough? That's unfortunate. All right, come on, spin. Spin. 
you're supposed to spin. Jump. Ding. Spin. Belly bumping. Love to see it. Jump. Roll. Spin. Bumping. Jump. Roll. Spin. Bump. Jump. Roll. Roll. Hey, what? Where's my spin? All right, here's the spin. Bump. Jump. Roll. Spin. Love to see it. I might have to squeeze in some golden slams if I run out. Which, luckily, we have spare FP right here. Oh, my damage. But we have to pay for it with, with trades. All right. We should be good on damage. I just need to not die. All right. Okay, there we go. Ow. No, oh, bro. What is this? Bing. I can't do anything off of that. I should be able to rotate this and go for a belly bump, though. Love to see it. Can I, there's no shot I can slam that, right? I mean, we got lucky, but that is not supposed to work. Now, this should work just fine. Very nice. Love to see it. Uh oh, Jesus Christ. Rolled too early. Oh, penis. Okay, we're good. Hey, you want to go for a jump? That'd be cool. Yeah, I didn't think so. Bing, bing. Ah, slam him. Love to see it. Can I do this? <laughs> oh, that was spooky. Okay, good. Hey. Ay, 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 ay. Ding. Ding. Rotate. Belly bump. Wait. Oh, oh, I didn't have FP. Ah, just don't get hit. How hard could it be? Oh, die. Let go! <laughs> so we're going to get bell bearings and then I think we're going to head underground before we take on fire giant. I want to head underground through here, I think. If Moog is proving to be really annoying, we can go do deer. Okay, so where are my punish windows going to be? So that's going to be one with a belly bump for sure. The thing is, I don't think we're going to quite have enough FP to get away with only belly bumps here. This should be an a Oh. Oh. Interesting. Okay, can I slam here? Not really. Okay, let's see if we delay. Yes, okay. That'll work. I can also maybe get away with... Uh, I'm not supposed to do this, but I'm doing it. 318. Okay, so that's that's what we're doing without the physic and without the ritual sword. Unideal. Can I charge this? No. Ow. Jesus. Really? Um. All right. Let's go. Let's go get our resources back. I'm gonna go for it. That has no business working as well as it did. 
belly bump. I think, I think we probably got enough damage. Oh my God, that was too early, but it works. I think we got enough damage in just belly bumps. Come on, chief. not good um with no ritual sword it's gonna be a lot closer as to whether or not we have enough fp but that's gonna help a lot yeah all right there we go now that i'm leveling up strength a little bit so that i can meet weapon requirements for the upcoming erd tree slam staff that makes the claw mark seal look like a good option since incantations scale with strength when using the claw mark seal so i take out an easy boss to pick up a death root give it to garank and spend some runes to catch it up to my finger seals level nice so we're gonna go get a new axe slam that's right bitch Thank you. Hey. Don't give me that shit. Hey. Hey. All right, hold on, hold on. Oh, that is not as much as I wanted. Roll. What is that? Cheating. Alright, cool. Sick. That's good news. Now I think I'm gonna be able to to poise through even this guy. I am the poise master. You you really want it? Alright, let's do it. Come on. Yeah. Bet you, you regret that choice now, huh, Lionel? Literally getting clapped up by some thick cheeks. Butt slam. 1351 on the slammer, dude. That's pretty nuts. Nice. All right, you grabby fuck. Oh, all right, there we go. Here comes the axe slam. Nice. Right in the mouth. Come here. Right in the mouth. Beautiful. All right, there we go. Um, should be deer time. Let's just, let's check. It did 903. It should do more damage, I think. Okay, I'm confused. <laughs> I thought deer was weak to holy. But I, I, I don't know. I don't, don't know. Okay. Um, can't make use of this. So might as well do that, I guess. Wait, wait, wait. It did a thousand and twenty-four right there. Hold on. Does it only do? Oh, I think I know what's happening. It's it, it has to do with the direct impact. I think. I think the direct impact doesn't scale with holy, but like that AOE AOE thing does faith damage or something. I don't know. What? How did that not hit him? Let's head over here right quick. Let's go see if we can take out a uh, fat man now. Ow. 
can I do this? <laughs> no. No, I cannot. Oh, come on. That doesn't hit. Come on. S sprint? What the fuck? Hello? Ow. Ah. Okay, we're good. Slam. Alright, a little belly bump to finish it off. Love to see it. Okay, so that means we now have noble presence. Since I have Noble Presence now, I pick up the Fire Scorpion Charm to buff its damage by a tiny amount. Since most of the damage is coming from the Black Flame status effect and not from the Fire Damage impact, Fire Scorpion Charm doesn't do a whole lot here. But something is better than nothing. I also pick up the Godskin Noble Robe, which buffs Noble Presence by 20%, and for the same reason as Fire Scorpion Charm, is also not very good. But again, something is better than nothing. After that, I pick up the God Slayer Seal, not because I wanted to use it, but instead because I wanted to put it in my offhand, that way I could get the passive buff to God Slayer incantations while still using the Claw Mark Seal for the better incantation scaling. As it turns out, for some reason, the game doesn't consider Noble Presence to be a God Slayer incantation and for that reason won't get buffed by the God Slayer seal. I didn't find this out until after I finished this run, so that's why you'll still see me using it even though it does nothing. Slam finds some value here. I think it's also the only thing that's going to break his anklet. Very nice. Very nice. Ooh, 3k. 3k with my thick cheeks, dude. Okay. There we go. Gotta be getting close to phase two, right? All right, sick. Fuck. I pressed the wrong button. You know what? It, it works. Good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, bud. Very nice. Is that in range? Oh, come on. All part of the plan, baby. I sense an issue. The good news is it looks like I don't need nearly as much blue flasks. The bad news is I have no idea how I'm going to do this. Um, I feel like we don't have a use for that. I don't know how that didn't hit me. I ain't gonna question it. Okay. I, I learned how to deal with Noble. Um, it seems to be pretty similar here. Dude. 
What the fuck? Okay, let's go see if we if we have some sort of different strategy here. Let's give it a try. Somehow, some way. Nice. That's definitely way too slow. Dude, what the fuck? Jesus Christ, man. Oh, fuck off. Right. Let's let's hope this makes it less of a disaster. Okay. Well, this should be interesting. I guess I only want to get him. What even fucking hits me? And fucking Skinny's already awake too, dude. This fucking move. No, dude. The biggest problem I'm running into in this fight is that I'm dying by only getting hit once or twice. So I need to be a little bit more damage resistant. I go to Crab Boy in Liernia, buy one prawn, reset the store, and buy as many boiled crab as I can get. These give 20% physical damage resistance for 60 seconds. I also pick up the Golden Vow incantation. I didn't pick it up before now because I don't think it's worth it for the damage buff. It'll end up using more FP than it will give back in the form of damage, but it might be worth it for the damage resistance buff if it makes it so that I don't get one or two shot. All right, well, let's just test it out just to see how it goes. I theoretically should have quite a bit more damage resistance and obviously a little bit more damage, which is nice. Okay. Very nice. Okay. So I think we can do this. Yeah, that looks like a strat to me. All right, we're doing a lot better on damage resistance, which I think makes a huge impact here. I know Fatty's gonna be waking up soon here. Please, for the love of God. Dude! What? Stop, dude. What am I? What the hell was that? What was I stuck on? Some fucking random pot on the ground? What is that? Oh my god. I'm out of FP. Oh my God, that's a nightmare. Oh yeah, fuck you. 
finally, with Godskin Duo dead, I have access to the end of Alexander's questline, which will give me a talisman that buffs all of my Ashes of War by 15%. I also gain access to a bunch of Ancient Dragon Smithing Stones to max out both my seal and my dagger. Slam! Oh boy. That was not a lot, was it? All right, what's Wrath of Gold saying? Okay, what's Noble Presence saying? Wow. I did not see that one coming. Not FP. Just keep belly bumping him. Okay, there we go. What? That didn't hit. Don't give me that. Huh? Huh? I'm getting scamazed here, dude. All right, there we go. Out of curiosity, though. Uh, was that 1148 by itself? Hold on. Oh. I mean, granted, we got a build that's much better suited for skills here. But that's looking like the strat, ain't it? Oh, come on. Come back here. Oh my dear lord that is not how i thought that was gonna go come on swing on me there you go big fella i bet i can find my way in the drip here beautiful right in the head <laughs> sit on his face I don't have FP. I all right, come here. Oh, oh, that's not what I thought it was. Come on, what is this? I got swept aside by the tail. Oh shit! In my eye. Okay, we're good. Okay, game. Stop bullshitting me here. Dude picked me up and tossed me into his follow-up attack. <laughs> All right, this is it, right? Thank you. Oh boy. What? I didn't roll that. So it, it seems like dealing with his summons is not the worst thing. That's good. Holy fucking long dicks on this man. All right, I see a problem. <laughs> Fuck, how did I not roll that? Not supposed to do that. That's why. All right, just stop getting hit. Okay, that, that's a bad start. <laughs> Woo. 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 Come on, where's the follow-up? Come on! Come on! Come on! 
I didn't think I was in range. Oh, fuck. Don't kill me. Hi! He's not even doing the move where he, he stomps on top of me. Oh, so easy. I hope she doesn't have significantly more poise. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Um, let's test Golden Slam. Okay. Golden Slam actually staggers her as well. It's obviously slower. Okay. All right. Have I bought myself enough? Yeah. I think I can Wrath of Gold for the rest of the things here. Okay, I got two bars left. I dodged too early? Damn it, dude. Stop with the swords. Ah, there we go. Sick. The reason I came to the Hallig Tree this early is not because I'm a masochist and want to fight Melania super underleveled, but instead because I want to gather these two talismans that will be useful for the build. Merica Sword Seal to be a slightly better version of Merica's Scar Seal and Dragon Crest Great Shield Talisman, which will be amazing against any boss that's doing physical damage like Malekith. Can I do this? No shot, right? Yeah. This? Maybe. Very nice. Ow. A bit ambitious. All right, sick. I think I can do two. Very nice. Jesus Christ. I don't think I've ever actually been hit by that. Most time I, I, I run off to the side. There we go. Nice and simple. Here to become Elden Lord. What a sad state of affairs. I commend your spirit, but alas, none shall take the throne. Mike has high hopes for us, and we continue to struggle unto eternity. I be wait. Oh my! Uh oh. Ah, lamp. Okay, that does a lot. Christ. Okay, so he used that, which makes him take more magic damage, which is cool. Roll. Oh, fuck. Could do, why does it do so much damage? Well, I found a use for the charge. <laughs> Ow. Ah, penis. Okay, I'm, I might want to butt slam him. Okay, like, getting him into the loop is nice, but it's also really difficult. Oh, I thought I would jump over it. No! You, well you, your spinny shit. Sick. K. 
Okay. And see you later, bud. I'm an idiot. <laughs> wait, wait, I I have an interesting question. Oh, it would have been so cool. Okay, I, I have to try again. Because I feel like we can get that jump there. Oh, okay. Oh, come on. Ow. <laughs> I'm honestly throwing by doing it. But whatever, we take those. Bro, what? What is happening? All right. Horaloo time. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we're just going to be oh, noble presencing the whole time here. So might as well have the God Slayer seal out. Ow. Hop! 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 Okay, we're good. Hop! Okay. He's a bit quick. I... Whoop! Whoop! Keep sprinting. Uh. All right. <laughs> okay, five twenty eight. What does this do? Five oh two. Okay. It does look like I'm probably going to want to try to find spots to slam at. Okay, I, I went too early there. Maybe rotating around him? And obviously when he's doing the duo and Unis. Okay. It would be a lot easier if I could just use Noble Presence the whole time. But I don't think it's going to work out like that. Okay. Very nice. I there we go. Very nice. Looking good. Oh, yeah. Literally have three spare blue flasks. Okay. Believe it's Melania time. Or at least Melania attempt time. Okay. She has hyper armor there. What? She has hyper armor there, so I don't know if a fully charged noble presence knocks her up into the air. I feel like it might. I feel like it probably should. Here, we probably just do uncharged noble presence. Same thing here. Can I do a, a butt slam here? Oh, maybe. I should test if I can get um, an uncharged noble presence off of the dodge to the left. Yes. Cool. How you gotta be quick on it though. Yeah, you gotta be Radigan's icon theoretically does something. Yeah, you know okay. Maybe maybe this might be the one and only time where Radigan's icon does something. <laughs> we aren't charging the well, we're not charging the spells often. Fully charged. Okay. No fully charged. Maybe butt slam. Fully charged? <laughs> oh, okay. You, you got to time it up. You, you probably can get her into a stun lock loop, but you got to time it up correctly.
and you have to get a move where you can actually take advantage like this one <laughs> I think I start holding as soon as I start seeing her move maybe uh can I okay as soon as she starts moving too early yeah good very good all right so that stun lock loops not really gonna apply to phase two because she kind of just like kicks out of it what are we doing bop F that didn't connect okay fully charged bop penis okay and the, there there's the the kick cancel that i was talking about one two three good all right very nice Beep. Beep. only took one hit yeah Oy, 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 oy. Didn't like that spot. Bang! All right, buddy. Unironically, that that is the first time I've seen Radigan's icon actually be any good. To prepare for right guard, which might seem impossible without the Serpent Hunter Spear, but with the right gear, it's definitely doable. I get the Bull Goat Talisman for extra poise, that way the lava won't stagger me as often, the Flame Drake plus two talisman, and the Pearl Drake plus two talisman for fire resistance, since I'm literally going to be standing in fire for the entire fight, and I also go to Renala to respec into a build that lets me have a lot of health, a lot of FP, and enough equip load so that I can use Lionel's set for even more poise. Okay, let's go there. Let's give myself blessing. All right, let's do it. Very nice. Doesn't seem to be doing as much damage as I would want. It's not going to be enough mana. I mean, it's going to be cutting it close, that's for sure. Yeah, this is what the snake does when you get up on him. He starts running. I'm trying to space out the cast a little bit more, too, to just be a bit more FP efficient. Um, yeah, it's, it's going to be close. We, uh, we started with nine bars total and now we have a little bit under five. But as you can see, the damage obviously scaled up with um the health bar are starlight shards viable for fp regen i suppose i don't think i picked any up oh i did pick one up all right it might matter we'll see okay i i need him to get into his aggressive phase life becomes a lot easier when he when he switches up his move set hit me okay i think he's in aggressive mode now i gotta run here though oh shit that's not good that's not good at all the thing is i i'm out of red flasks as well kind of just out of resources okay let's cast that and then Spend the rest of the FP on attacks. Maybe Starlight Shard gets it done. No, 
Really? Seems like incant scaling actually does kind of matter. I think we can take some of these vigor levels and toss them into faith and then level the god skin seal. Cool. I don't remember how much I was doing before, but we're doing 807 now. Okay. If he starts backing up for the sake of resource preservation, I think I have to do this and then bait out some sort of attack like that. But then he just starts fucking backing up again. Stop fucking running. Dog, you are being unreasonable. Stop running. Please, dude. The the serpent is definitely the worst part of this fight when you actually have to fight him like this. Cool. Like I said, most of the damage that we're doing is from uh, percentage-based status effects. No, come on. I'm out of range there. Come on. Okay, that's the last red. Uh oh, I, I'm 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 just too close. How how did I end up being so close to him? All right, now let's see. Thousand and fifty nine. So it it really is not much better. It's cheaper, which is nice. It does it does require direct hits. It's slower though. Yeah, definitely more FP efficient, no doubt in that. This move also has like some wacky hyper armor as well. Which is obviously a benefit. It's nice that he got stuck. This is convenient. Okay. Flame protect me. Blessing. What? I got staggered by the fire right as he went for the swing. That's so unfortunate. Okay. Good. Let's go, dude. No, that didn't connect. Come on. Wait. Doing well. Got plenty of FP. All right, there we go. That's the execution. Flame protect me. Can I? Okay. I didn't know if Radigan had player like poise. Thought I would test. Looks like the answer is no. Wasn't supposed to weave there. Also not supposed to weave there. Because Radigan's weak to fire, it, it seems like straight up Noble Presence might just be the strat 
Unless we have like F ow, FP concerns. Oh, the hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Why is it doing both 990 with and without the seal equipped? Maybe it's a positioning thing? Maybe you do more damage if you're closer to him? When he's teleporting, he's invincible, so he doesn't take damage over time. Well, uh, that makes sense. Okay, so again, I still need to figure out 824. And then with this, it's... Okay, shouldn't the God Slayer seal be buffing this incantation? The God Slayer seal doesn't buff Noble Presence. Why? <laughs> Excuse me. Hey. Love to see it. I There we go Love to see it since you enjoyed this video and made it to the end, check out this other challenge run popping up on screen. Also, one of my sponsors, Advanced and Energy Supplement, is running a promo right now. They just released brand new cans instead of the powder format that it usually comes in, so go check it out and use my code BUSHY30 at checkout for 30% off for the next five days.